the ghost face will strike again. Woods bro is once again under the shadow of darkness. Something about this one just feels different. To save the new targets and to unleash the mystery of the man behind the mask, the survivors of the past massacres, Sidney Prescott, played by Neve Campbell, Gail Weathers, played by Courtney Cox, and Dewey Riley, played by David Ackett, return to their hometown. Whatever is link is to our past, it's pulled us all back here. It is anticipated that the screams while watching this sequel will be louder than ever before. Go finish it, Sydney. <laughs> Halloween Ends will pick up four years after the previous edition and bring the story to present day. The thirst for revenge is deep-seated in the minds of Laurie Strode, played by Jamie Lee Curtis, and her granddaughter, Alison Nelson, played by Andy Madichak, due to the previous murders of friends and family. It will all end with the final installment of the trilogy, Halloween Ends, that might just succeed to haunt you for the rest of your life. The more he kills, the more he transcends. Run! Go home now! The fans of this genre are really looking forward to the revival of a successful movie from the past that will debut on Hulu. The Hellraiser originally came out in 1987 and since then 11 feature films of the series have made it to the big screen. Earlier played by Doug Bradley, this time Jamie Clayton will play the notorious horror icon Pinhead. The lead role will be played by Odessa Asian in this franchise reboot for which the audience already has very high expectations. Sony is pulling Marvel Cinematic Universe into the horror genre with Mobius. Story of a biochemist, Dr. Michael Mobius, played by Jared Leto. Trying to find a cure to his rare blood disease and experimenting with bats he inadvertently falls prey to a form of vampirism. What did you do to yourself, Doctor? I wish I knew. Fighting the monster of his own creation, the devil will finally be unleashed on us this April. Are you here to heal the world? Or to destroy it? Hoping for a spine-chilling climax in the fifth movie of the series, which is a reboot coming after 10 years of wait. Written and directed by Lee Cronin, produced by Robert Tapert, with Sam Raimi and Bruce Campbell serving as executive producers. The nightmare begins when Ellie and Beth, two sisters, accidentally find something. Probably the Necronomicon Ex Mortis an old book to call upon the supernatural evil powers and they scare even the bravest of hearts. Evil Dead Rise is all set to release on HBO Max just in time for this Halloween. The story of Lena Klammer, played by Isabel Furman, posing as the lost daughter of a couple played by Julia Stiles and Rosie Sutherland is even more terrifying than what she did to the Coleman family. Now. We need to trace back to her past and find out when the evil seed sprouted. Destroying a beautiful family wasn't the first horrendous kick of the child named Esther. She had fooled others before and this January we will witness the first kill. It's time to save the town from the spreading plague of vampirism. It all started when Ben Mears, a writer, returned to his childhood house in Jerusalem's lot, also known as Salem's lot, and with him also visited an ancient evil. Louis Pullman, portraying the character of Ben, soon discovers that this wicked presence is turning the people. The question is, will he be able to find a solution in time? Leatherface has returned to the city of Texas 
and so has the evil echo of the chainsaw brutally murdering innocents. This cannibal strikes again when Melody, her teenage sister Lila and their friends heading to the town of Harlow by mistake destroy his home. Beware and be quick to escape the chains of the saw before you get clutched. Bringing some big guns like Harry Styles, Florence Pugh, Gemma Chan and Chris Pine to the world of horror, Olivia Wilde has directed this psychological horror and thriller. The plot of the movie is based on a utopian experimental community where a 1950s housewife doubts that her husband's company is hiding some dark and horrific secrets. Nope, we are not really sure what the storyline of this horror film directed by Jordan Peele is going to be like. Though, it's safe to say it will be just as thrilling and terrifying as his other projects, Get Out and Us. The cast of Nope includes Daniel Kaluuya, K.K. Palma, Barbie Ferreira and Steven Yeun. Dark Harvest, as the name suggests, is a harvest season ghost story where the whole town chases after October Boy, an apparition with a butcher knife in an event called The Run. The movie is set in a midwestern town and the time is that of Halloween, 1963. There is also a novel that came out in 2007 by the same name which is the inspiration for the film. <laughs>